Hello there students, thank you for being part of this presentation today. And uh, our topic for today is United States History, Semester A. And we're looking at Unit 5, which is From War to Recovery. And our main focus for this particular tutorial is, or lesson, is the Great Depression tutorial. Please make sure that you have your notebook with you, so you can take notes as you are reviewing this tutorial. And the objective for this tutorial is that you will characterize the causes and effects of the Great Depression. Let's move on. We are now on page 8 of the Great Depression tutorial and uh, you're basically just moving tiles here. Let's read the directions to see what you need to do. Label each statement about the economy before the stock market crash of 1929. So you're given a whole bunch of descriptions here and you need to determine if those descriptions are either true or false. Once you're done with it, please make sure you hit the submit button and uh, you can move on to the next activity. We are now on page 14 of the Great Depression tutorial. This is your lesson activity on the impact of the Great Depression. Let's read the directions so you know what to do here. Read the instructions for this self-check activity, type in your response to each question and check your answer. At the end of the activity, write a brief evaluation of your work. Activity. Read the article, The Human Meaning of the Great Depression. Then use the information from the article and your knowledge of the Great Depression to answer the following questions. And then you have part A. It says, briefly explain how the Great Depression impacted the lives of individuals in one of the following groups. So what you're doing here, you need to go to this link. And once you go to this link, you should get a whole bunch of information that will help you answer this question. And uh, you're basically picking one group here. You have women, African Americans migrant laborers, farmers, and you need to talk about them basically based on the information that you have gathered from here and the information from the previous pages of this tutorial. Make sure you provide a good paragraph here explaining how the lives of these people were impacted. Let's move on to part B. Choose a second group and briefly explain how the Great Depression impacted the lives of individuals in that group. So you're doing the same thing. You're picking another group here and you're basically telling me or telling the teacher what exactly was happening with that group of people. How did the Great Depression impact that group of people? Part C. Compare and contrast the experience. Individuals of the two groups you choose, noting any similarities and differences between individuals of the groups. So all you're doing here is you're looking at both responses. Your response from part A, your response from part B, and you're comparing them. Did one group specifically suffer more? Did one group did not suffer? You need to tell me the, the differences as well as similarities. Did both gr groups, for example, did not have anything to eat? Did both groups lose their jobs? And uh, you need to give me a solid paragraph here too. Let's move on to the next activity. We're now on page 25 of the Great Depression tutorial. And uh, let's read what you need to do here for this activity. Drag each label to the correct location in on the image. Identify which policies and organizations were created during Hoover's term as president by dragging each one to the appropriate category. So all you're doing here, uh, you're looking at the different acts here, the different administrations, and uh, you're letting me know if it was created by Hoover or if it was not created by Hoover. Once you have fully moved the tiles to where they belong, and you are 100% sure that you are correct, you hit the submit button and go on to the next page of the tutorial. And I will see you in the next tutorial as basically we're done with this activity here.